Okay, YouTubers and anti-nuke activists, I want to take a look at a couple of emails here from the 15th of March, just a few days after the Fukushima catastrophe. And let's look at the one from 3.41 p.m. on March 15th from Paul Machalik to Duncan White, Monica Orendi, Daniel Collins, Timothy Riley, and David McIntyre. David McIntyre, who is a really big player in this Flimgate cover-up. And Paul says, All, oh, the Massachusetts governor's office is going to issue a press release tomorrow morning concerning the Springfield Armory DU depleted uranium issue. Bob Gallagher has promised to send a copy of the press release to NRC as soon as it is drafted, parentheses assumed tonight. And then we have another email from 4.02 p.m., about 20 or so minutes afterwards, from David McIntyre, uh, sent back to this group of people, Duncan White, Monica Arendi, Daniel Collins, Timothy Riley, Paul Michalik. And he says, ah, the old, quote, shove this out the door while the world is looking elsewhere, end quote, Floyd. How can anyone get alarmed over possible DU at Springfield while Japan is going all to hell and the West Coast is threatened? Brilliant, big block letters, brilliant, though he might want to wait until 4 p.m. Friday. And again, McIntyre is totally down with this kind of game plan. He's just a little bit of tongue-in-cheek humor for these guys there. Who This is par for the course. This is their methods. This is their methodology. This is how they operate. And the, quote, shove this out the door while the world is looking elsewhere, well, yes, that is, that is what they use. That is exactly what they use, diversionary, distractionary, slipping something in while you're looking elsewhere. And I've been very clear on that. And you can also get some other stuff out of this couple of emails here where David McIntyre is kind of admitting Japan is going all to hell. I mean, again, worst case scenario can't get any worse with, with a prolonged station blackout and no power and no water for weeks and weeks. And the West Coast is threatened. See, they knew the whole time the West Coast was threatened. I mean, throughout the document, there's plenty of indication of that. And that's part of the whole reason why they downplay the modeling on four to five days of emission so Obama can say it's harmless levels of radiation, so on and so forth. And I cover all of this in my book, which is free to the general public at HatrickPenryUnbound.com. The book is titled Something Wicked This Way Comes, the story of Plume Gate, the world's largest provable cover-up. Okay, and that's what I wanted to cover on this very short video, um, focusing on these two emails right here. I mean, it's pretty um, eye-opening to know that this is just how they operate. When you read into these FOIA documents, again, it's insight into the cover-up, insight into the conspiracy. How do they do it? What do they talk about? What's their methods? What's their strategy? What's their tactics? I include all that in the book, and this is just another um, brilliant example, as he says, brilliant. Though he might want to wait until 4 p.m. Friday. They know the perfect time to release. It's like going to war with Syria. When does Obama start getting serious about it? Football season's cranking up. And they'll come out late on a Friday night or like the NDAA on New Year's Eve and pass these bills. That's exactly how they work. So they wouldn't have to do this, obviously, if, they're, if the nuclear industry was not as dangerous as we say it is. Again, you don't have to do damage control on the solar power industry, and they don't this kind of... Now, shenanigans does not occur in the solar power industry. Okay, that's it. Thanks for joining in for this video. Patrick Penry, over and out. Uh, we need to get subscribed and get this unity stronger and beat YouTube at their own game. Okay, that's what this is about. Like I say, go to the remix button, hit the remix button, that way you'll have this video and and keep up with this. Otherwise, you know, YouTube's just going to control us, guys, and it's, it's really...